Well, hello, BookTube, YouTube, and all those who seem to give a hoot. Today I'm reviewing The Age of Ra by James Lovegrove. All I have to say is this, well, I've got a lot to say, a lot to say, but this was a wild ride. Um, James Lovegrove is a British writer, um, the subgenre of God Punk. This was probably so far the best thing I've read by him. I think I have another one of his books I've got to review, which I'll be putting up later, The Age of Voodoo, which wasn't as good as this, but it was still pretty good. Uh -huh. um, let's go to the back, shall we? The Age of Ra. The ancient Egyptians' gods have defeated all the other pantheons and proclaimed dominion over the earth, divided it into warring factions. Lieutenant... David West Winter, Winter, West Winter, a British soldier stumbles into Frigyp, the only place to have remained independent of the gods' influence. Frigyp is actually Egypt right now, but it's free because none of the gods could decide who could take over, so it's an independent territory ruled over by warlords. So Frigyp is the only place to have remained independent of the gods' influence. There he encounters the followers of a humanist leader known as the Lightbringer, who has vowed to rid mankind of the shackles of divine oppression. As the world heads towards an apocalyptic battle, there is far more to this freedom fighter than it seems. And that is definitely true. So, One of the coolest parts of this is the fact that there are mummies that they use in the battlefield. And the Egyptian priesthood is the ones that seem to have the most power in this book. It also goes back and forth between the actual physical world and the world of the gods. It gets into descriptions of how the Egyptian pantheons wiped out all the other pantheons and deities. Um, it's pretty awesome. It breaks down into different sects. And it seems like the sects, the different gods, have broken off into different... I guess factions, and they actually war against each other on the physical plane. Um, if you got time, I definitely encourage you to check this out. It's sci-fi, god punk, which is one of my favorite sub-genres. Um, James Lovegrove is actually one of my favorite writers. It started with the book The Age of Zeus, um, which was good, uh, but I read that like 10 years ago, so not so much now. Uh, so there's the cover. Definitely worth checking out if you're into um, Egyptology, paganism, or anything. This is what it would be like if the Egyptian gods ruled our world. So, there's definitely a lot of stuff in here that came about unexpectedly. It's kind of a, a thriller. So, pretty cool book. Um, they go over the different orders and the temples, and it discusses the origins of belief and how... Our personal belief actually gives the gods power. It talks about how they fought their wars with the other... I already said that. With their other deities. But that was a pretty cool part. Um, it's awesome. So definitely check out The Age of Ra by James Lovegrove. Um, I gave it five stars. Awesome. Hail Ra. Alright. Till next time. 